This is the river that maroons and displaces residents of Grand River year after year. The residents say over the years they are flooded out and lose furniture and appliances. This resident believes the river needs to be either drenched or rerouted. We had to get the river drenched because everything going down in the river mouth and remaining down there in muddy and, and then again the fishermen now. For the river to remain open yearly, right? They block the hydro flow. They keep blocking the hydro flow. That it, when the water builds up, it does go through the hydro flow before the river mouth open, right? So that does help with the amount of water then. But when you block the hydro flow now, for years the river keep running and it's not. Another resident said they wrote to the Ministry of Works and to date no official has visited the area. When works came, they said the solution would be to dredge the river, not just from here, but further up, and to bring it all the way down past this bridge, right the way down into the sea. Right? So they've had the letter, coastal erosion has had it. Works did say that the issue might be that there's not anyone important enough living in Grand Riviere for it to be seen as, as serious. But for all the villages that live here, these are important people, and Grand Riviere is environmentally a very important place. She becomes worried once heavy showers fall, as the inclement weather also affects her livelihood. My concern is not just for, for me, it's the entire village. It starts off with the village being, the, the river being flooded, uh, the river flooding, the, the dredging of the river not happening, so that what happens is that there's nowhere for, the, for anything to flow out. The entire village is affected because they're flooded, people lose property every year, Every year, it's becoming more and more of a, of a dangerous situation. To this end, the residents are calling on some short-term measure to be implemented to prevent them flooding out. Charlene Lewis, TTT News.